Hello everybody, this is Lodge, and today I am once again talking about another Nintendo Direct announcement that I am super excited for, and I'm actually like super super excited for this one, like I'm even doing it as soon as I can, because it's Xenoblade Chronicles 3, and I love Xenoblade Chronicles, it's like, I kind of attribute Xenoblade Chronicles to the first one that was actually re-released on the 3DS, like the new 3DS, as my like the game that really got me into JRPGs and just like RPGs in general because I played that game a whole ton like four years ago and then after that it's just been history like I've been playing so many RPGs like I'm playing Mass Effect but oh my gosh like two years ago oh my gosh I'm sorry been two years the uh, Definitive Edition for the first thing to play got released and I'm like oh this looks so cool and it was so good and then I haven't played Future Connected all the way through sadly yet and I'm gonna now because this game looks awesome. It just looks so good. And I highly recommend you play Xenoblade. Just any of them. One, Definitive Edition, two, X. I'm also surprised we're getting three and not X. I mean, I kind of get it. X hasn't got released on Nintendo Switch yet, sadly. Like that game would do so well on that game, on the system. Like, come on, Monolith Soft slash Nintendo, please. I want more people to play X, because X is also... X may be my least favorite Xenoblade game, but Xenoblade games are like 10 out of 10s, so it's still super good. And I, I'm just excited. It's coming out in like September. They didn't give a firm release date, so it could change. So it could change even if they did give us a firm release date. But right now, September is also when my birthday's coming around, so it kind of lines up. So was it meant to be? Yes, it was. I mean, ugh, this game just looks so good. I don't even know what to talk about because I don't want to spoil anything for the past two games, even though they all happen in their own, like, universe. You know, they're not. It's like Final Fantasy. They aren't really connected. They just have, like, a few characters that have, like, similar names. But, yeah. That's all I really wanted to talk about. Uh, I'm really excited for this game. I just wanted a short video just to say how excited I was because I love Xenoblade. Xenoblade's, like, one of my top tier. Um, top tier series. It's, and Monster Hunter just is great. Monster Hunter just does great on like all of their stuff. So, any game from them is a uh, 10 out, it's probably going to be a 10 out of 10 for me. And I, I saw, I said it on Twitter, but this will be my game of the year, most likely. Which is crazy, because like Breath of the Wild 2 potentially could come out this year. Bayonetta 3 is coming out this year. It, we, we got all the sequels this year. This literally is so far a 2017-2 for Nintendo. And I'm really excited because Xenoblade's coming. So yeah, if you enjoyed the video, want to hear me maybe talk about more Xenoblade sometimes. I think I should do more Xenoblade videos now because, duh. You should subscribe and maybe watch some more videos of mine. I don't know, I have a Bandit 3 video that I do kind of talk about the same stuff. Yeah, I hope you have a good day and goodbye.